Well, let's put this in context also. I grew up doing a variety of things on the farm. I helped prepare for the hog killing every winter, which was the food that we ate for the rest of the year. Uh, I thought I was going to be a veterinarian, and my father took me out, and I vaccinated chickens and de-beaked them and uh, did an awful lot of other interesting animal uh, uh, science things. I understand that animals on the farm are not like household pets. They clearly have a different role. We ob ob obviously should not be mistreating animals, but we need to feed people on a large scale. We need to do it safely, and we need to do it responsibly. Unfortunately, there are extremists who try to characterize any animal food production as inhumane. That is not the case. But if there are bad apples out there, those who fall below the industry standard, they should be dealt with. Livestock production has been a lifeline for eastern North Carolina. One of the things that we've suffered from in years past has been a rural brain drain when young people felt like they had to leave places to get a better uh, income to be able to support their family. They moved away from a place that they'd like to be. I watched in neighboring Sampson and Duplin counties where the livestock industry increased, it seemed like, almost in a very short period of time, the per capita in time income by about $10,000 per person. That livestock operation in those counties preserved farm families and a rural way of life for them. Livestock is important to this state. It needs to continue. We need to have livestock production. We need to be able to export these products, and we need to create jobs in North Carolina through the livestock industry. Thank you, Secretary.